Okay, guys, let me show you how you can interact with today's smart contract using the TronScan website, okay? So you will interact directly with the blockchain uh, without using the front end. As you probably know, the front end or the dashboard, the back office is having some challenges right now. It, it doesn't display the correct data. So it doesn't allow you to uh, register properly or upgrade your packages. And um, this is just this is just the front end, okay? And this is being fixed as we speak, right? But the back end, the smart contract, the blockchain side of things uh, are working perfectly fine. So there are no glitches, no issues whatsoever, right? And um, in this uh, in this presentation, I'm going to show you how you can register uh, with Daisy and buy your packages, interacting with the smart contract using TronScan, okay? So I'm here on the smart contract, okay? This is the, the number of the smart contract, as you can see, okay? And you will find uh, the link to this contract down below, or just get it from your sponsor, okay? If you watch that video and it has no link below, okay? So this is the smart contract. All right, so if you want to interact with the smart contract, you will have to go to contract here down below and then go to write contract, okay? So let me click on write contract. And then those are the two sections that you will be using to interact with the DAISY smart contract. Okay, this, this is the area where you will be upgrading your packages. And this is the area where you will be registering, okay? So all you need to register is the Tron address of your sponsor you will need a username that you wanna use and you will just enter the Tron amount uh, to buy your pack, okay? And you also need uh, the Tron link extension, the, the Tron link Google Chrome extension. So I'm using Google Chrome here and uh, all you need to do to interact with the with the smart contract is a Tron link extension. So you will find the Tron link extension here on tronlink.org and you just go to Chrome extension and that will take you to the Chrome web store. Okay, you just uh, add the add-on, you know, to your, to your browser and yeah, and create an account, okay? So let me click on my Tron link extension. So I am logged out currently. So let me just log in quickly. All right, so you can, uh, you can create a new wallet if you click on, on the plus here on the plus icon, or you can uh, create, you can create a new one or you can restore an existing, an existing wallet, right? Let me show that quickly. So if you wanna create a new one, you hit here. If you want to restore your existing wallet, so you potentially have set up Clever, you know, because that was our initial recommendation. Um, but now we know that TronLink is the best wallet to to use with Daisy. So if you hit restore and then set up a uh, account name, let's say Daisy tutorial, and then you hit continue and then you hit private key. And now you paste your private key from your Clever wallet. So you just go to the settings 
you know, to the settings of your Clever Wallet. And then you go to Backup Wallet. You enter your PIN and then you click, okay, got it. Uh, you choose the, the account you wanna backup and then you, 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 you pick the, the private key and you paste it into, into your Tron link extension and then you just continue, okay? All right. So now let me go back to the smart contract. So before we can interact with the smart contract, we need to connect our wallet, okay? So to connect your wallet, you just hit this button here, okay? You just say connect wallet. It will ask you, is it a ledger or a Tron link? You say Tron link. And then you just connect. Okay, now you're in this. Now you're in your account. This is your uh, Tron wallet address, as you can see. So now we need to go back to the to the smart contract. Okay, uh, let me pick the smart contract number. So now we go to the smart contract again, and now we go to contract and write contract. And now it will look slightly different because that will show you your balance here. You see? Okay, this is your balance. Okay, to register, you enter your sponsor's Tron address here. Uh, you enter your desired username here. And then you enter the amount uh, of Tron here, okay? So to, to, to figure out what the amount should be, uh, you can go to CoinGecko, for instance, and then search for Tronix, let's say. And to have an idea what a $100 package would be, so this is approximately 3,352. So you can go, go back to the contract you can go to uh, transactions, right? Let me refresh and check for the latest transactions and see what amount is coming closer to the $100 package. This is most probably, no, this is most certainly a $100 pack, okay? So CoinGecko is showing this amount and this is a different source, you know, than, than uh, Tronscan is using. Tronscan is using the Poloniex data and CoinGecko is using a composite of different exchanges. So this is the approximate amount and this is the exact amount, okay? So, and this happened a minute ago, you see. So even that we have uh, price fluctuations, uh, you just grab the, the latest, the latest amount. And this is a $200 pack, most probably. Okay, so let me pick this one and we will see if you fail transactions, this is just because gas is missing or energy, out of energy, you see. So I just pick this um, amount here and then I enter it here, right? So now I paste the Tron address of my sponsor, just reach out to your sponsor asking what his or her Tron address is, okay? And then here you just enter the desired username, okay? Let me do, not sure if this one already exists, i just add a number. Okay, so it has to be lowercase and it can be letters and numbers. So, and now I just hit send, okay? So the, the Tron link extension will prompt me to accept the transaction, right? And, and that's it. I mean, if you see that message here, no value return, 
That's a good one, okay? So this means that, that it worked, okay? So, and we can actually verify. So we just grabbed the address from your Tron link extension, you know, we enter it here and see if that transaction was successful. We go to transactions, you see success. Okay, so we have successfully registered with a hundred dollar pack. Okay, so this is good. So now what we want to do now is we want to upgrade. Okay, we want to upgrade to the second pack. How do we do that? We use this section right here. Okay, we enter the pack tier. Okay, tier two, three, four, five, and we enter the amount, the Tron amount. Okay, so let me do that quickly. I will go back to the smart contract. Uh, and by the way, this is the address I'm using now to sign up. And this transaction, the first transaction will include the smart contract number. You just click on the smart contract and then you go to transactions and then you watch for a $200 pack. Again, we can go back to CoinGecko. We can enter 200. So the amount should be close to this value here, 6,704. Um, yeah, that one looks good. Okay. That's the one. And this is, this is basically, you just, you just double the amount. I mean, we use that one for the hundred dollar pack. This is the double of a hundred dollar pack. So this is 200. And what we do now, we just say pack two and we enter the the required amount okay then we hit send so tron link will again notify us uh, and we just confirm just takes a couple of seconds uh, so if you get this arrow here and this is this is i'm actually pleased that we get this arrow now so this is just demonstrate that it demonstrates that it that didn't work so you try again until you get uh, this message here, okay? Um, let me see how this is looking now on my address. You see, it failed, okay? So that means we have to try again, but yeah. So the, the key takeaway here is, I mean, if you log in into your front end, into your DAISY account in your Tron link wallet, and uh, it will show you some data, you know, you can verify that, that data using the Tron scan website. Okay. So if, uh, if your front end is showing two packages, you just go back to the, to your Tron address on TronScan and just verify if that's true. If you see a transaction transaction like this, then you have package one. If you see a transaction like this uh, with a success label, then you have pack two. Okay, because some people go in and uh, see no packages, you know, and uh, start to panic. But uh, if you go to the blockchain, you can actually see those packages. Okay, so the, the packages are not gone. So, uh, so if they are not being, being displayed on the front end, it doesn't mean they are gone. I mean, they will be in the back end. And again, the back end is working perfectly fine. Okay, uh, it's just the front end that is experiencing some issues, but this is being solved, as I mentioned. And uh, yeah, and once this is solved, I mean, we will have we will have a lot of fun with Daisy. Okay, guys. Um, I hope you like this tutorial. Um, if you if you need more information on Daisy, just uh, just uh, join our Telegram Telegram link uh, that you will find down below, and yeah, and ask questions. Okay. Thanks for watching. See you soon.